good. Hey guys, my name is John Michael. This is my YouTube channel. This is actually my first video. Um, so if you would please subscribe and please like and comment if you like are into the video. If you vibe with it, please let me know. Show your love. I was going to do the 50 facts about me tag, but I decided that I was going to do just like like maybe 10 random facts about me because I honestly did not want to do 50 facts and make the video be like 50 million years long. So let's go on and get into the video. I hope you guys enjoy. Number one, I am very, very OCD. Like I have to have things done a certain way. Uh, I am a very, like I'm such a clean freak. I do not like nastiness. Number two is that I am very outgoing. I have a very bright personality. Um, it's sometimes a little much for people because I live in the South and this is like the Bible Belt so people are like conservative and very very like withdrawn. You're supposed to act a certain way in public and that's just that is not jam okay that's not me i do not care what people think number three i am a singer i love music i love everything about it i love the idea of it thank god for the person who created music love you like at me on twitter please you know um but i am a singer and i've had some really great opportunities and I really hope that there's more in store for me, but that's all just a prayer, a dream, and hopefully a blessing one day that I get to say that was a blessing. Number four would be that I love deep combos. Like, I love deep conversations because it's so, like, I want to sit in a car with somebody at three o'clock in the morning and talk about their problems, talk about my problems. I am so that person and I will always be that person. I love deep conversations. Like if you want to tell me how you hurt your big toe sliding down your aunt's backyard swing, okay, just do it. I want to have a deep combo with you. Fact number five, I am very clumsy. Like God cursed me with clumsiness because I trip over my own big toe nail. I'm clumsy. I'm really clumsy. Number six is I hate, I hate, oh my God, I hate it so much when people are like young people are really, really, really slow. Like they move really, really slow. Sweetie, you and your bones have a great relationship right now. Please move your booty faster because Lord have mercy when I'm in line at Walmart or at Target or wherever I may be that day. I do not want to be behind somebody that cannot pick up their jug of milk fast enough for me to get out the store because I got to be at work in five minutes. I'm not trying to do that, okay? So if you are young and you and your bones have a great little relationship, please tell your bones and yourself, we're going to make it happen today. We're going to move a little faster. Amen. And number seven is another thing that I really, really can't stand. And that is when somebody says that they're going to do one thing and then does the complete opposite or does not do that thing at all. Like if we made plans... If we, oh yes, this is so good. This is such a great analogy. If I made plans or we made plans mutually for the weekend or for like just a day to go out to lunch together, don't cancel. Don't, don't not show up. Don't text me and say, let's do it another time. Because when you say, let's do it another time, it never happens. It's never like that. It's done. It's dead. It's over. Why? Why do people do that? I don't get it. I am that person sometimes though. Number eight, I don't like pizza. I, like everybody that I know absolutely loves pizza, gives so much credit to pizza. And even though I'm Italian, like I just don't like it. I don't like the bread and like I just, mm -mm, mm -mm. not me, not Jay. Number nine is the fact that I 
am in year 2017 and I am still alive. Um, this, like, past years have been such a roller coaster and uh, an all around kind of bad experience. I mean, there were good points. I've always been blessed. I've always been super, super blessed. But I did battle with depression and self harm. Um, I battled with it very, 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 very bad. And I have come such a long way. I have come out of my shell so much. Like, to be doing this right now is so out of my, like, comfort zone. Singing for a video is one thing, but talking, like, in a video and trying to be myself and not be something I'm not, that is so out of my comfort zone. So, props to me, honestly, because, uh... It feels so good to be like, to just be free from all of that. And if you're not, and if you still do struggle with self-harm or depression, please, please DM me, private message me, and we can talk. Cause like I said, baby, I love deep conversations. I would love to give you advice, and I would love to just be there for you, for somebody that you can just vent to. I wanna be that person. And fact number 10, the last one. I hate my job. That last fact was so anticlimactic, and I am so sorry, but it was very necessary and very true because that is just, that's just like the real world for you, sweetie. So I hope you guys loved this video. And if you didn't love it, then I hope you liked it. If you didn't like it, then why are you even still here? You probably do like it. Loki. So if you did like it, then please hit that subscribe button and let me know that you're there and comment on this video and tell me what I did wrong, how my eyebrows look, they are screwed up right now. Tell me how beautiful this hat is because it actually is so beautiful. You guys have a blessed week, a blessed 2017. We are praying for it in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And I will be seeing you again. I hope you will be seeing me again. So turn them post notifications on. Yes, ma'am.